Will my lender send me a 1099 on the debt forgiven? In 2007, the U.S. Congress passed the Mortgage Debt Forgiveness Relief Act. Uh, just go to the irs.gov website, and it's in effect until 2012. As a result of that act, borrowers no longer pay taxes on the debt forgiven on their primary residence. So if your property is your primary, primary residence, then no, you shouldn't have to pay a 1099, although by law, your lender's still supposed to send the 1099. You just file an extra form. And I've written some blog articles on my website as well. For investment property, the lender does have the right and the obligation to report to the IRS the amount they have forgiven in a short sale transaction. The amount of the resulting tax, remember, will be far less than the debt forgiven. For example, we had one client who did get a 1099 for $30,000 forgiven. This resulted in an additional taxes of $1,300 for the year. The resulting tax is, of course, far superior to paying the difference of the debt. Also, if the property is in foreclosure, the foreclosure would have a much more devastating effect on you than the amount of the 1099. And also, there are some offsetting factors that may help with the 1099. If you're insolvent, per the bankruptcy code's definition, you may be eligible not to have to pay taxes on the 1099. Also, depending on your tax basis, um, you may be able to have losses on the price of your home offset the supposed phantom uh, forgiven phantom income on that debt. We advise you to seek the advice of a competent tax professional before starting a short sale. 